This video is about how to measure distances in map. Here in the map I have two different data sets plotted. The stores that I own in orange and the distribution centers that I own in blue. Now let's say that I want to find the distances between a few of my stores. So for example, San Fernando and Burbank. So to do that I come up here to this little line button and I click on that and then I'm just going to click where San Fernando is and then I can just go all the way down to where Burbank is and I can see that it's about 10.97 miles. So then if I want to make another click, I can then see, let's say, how far away I am from Glendale. So then I hover over Glendale and I can see that it's about 13 and a half miles. And then I can click again. And I can continue to do this and the miles will always be the total miles of the line. So I'm just going to make a couple more clicks just so that you can see how it is. And then all I do to finish it is I click here on the last point. Then I can also draw a circle with a specified radius and find all the pins within that radius. So let's say that, for example, I wanted to draw a 20 mile radius around this pin right here. So to do that, I come up here to this circle button and I click on that. Then I'm going to hover over this blue pin, which is one of my distribution centers. I'm going to click and start to drag. And obviously you can see the radius off to the right, so I'm just going to continue to drag until I reach about 20 miles. And there you go. Now you can see this circle that I drew. It took me very little time. And if I want to, I can then click on the circle itself. And as a reminder, I can see how large the circle is as far as radius, diameter, and all those different geometrical measurements. Then I can also see the distribution centers and sales data pins that fall within that circle. And then if I click on location report, I can then see the data about each and every one of those pins. And Plus, I can download this information into an Excel spreadsheet as well as anything in the summary report. And that's how easy it is to measure distances using MapLine.